Welcome to Space and Galaxy Facts, everybody! Whenever we talk about the universe, our thoughts evolve around the sun, the moon, galaxies, and planets. While thinking about planets, after Earth, the first planet we think of is Mars. The planet Mars has been an attraction in past decades for space geeks, astronomers, and scientists. So as you know today, our subject of discussion is Mars. Mars is also called the Red Planet. Mars is a constant point of discussion for space explorers around the world. We've sent dozens of spacecraft there to study it. Some want to land astronauts on it. The planet is just far away enough to make that dream difficult, but just close enough to spark our imagination. It is a center of attraction because there is a possibility that it can give a new home to mankind to thrive outside of the Earth. So what are some of the most important things to learn about the Red Planet? Buckle up your seatbelts, we're going to take you on a virtual trip to Mars. So hello everybody, you are watching Space and Galaxy Facts, and today we're going to tell you some astonishing facts about Mars. One, Mars had water in the ancient past. We've been debating for centuries about whether Mars had life or not. In fact, the astronomer Percival Lowell misinterpreted observations of canali, the Italian word for channels, on the planet as evidence of alien-made canals. It turned out Lowell's observations were hampered by poor telescope optics of his day, and the canals he saw were optical illusions. That said, several spacecraft have spotted other signs of ancient water. Channels grooved in the terrain and rocks that only could have been formed in the presence of water. In fact, the Curiosity rover's mandate on Mars right now is to search for habitable environments, in the past or present. Mars has a thin atmosphere that does not allow water to flow or remain in large quantities on the surface, but we know for sure that there is ice at the poles, and possibly frosty locations elsewhere on the planet. The question is if the ice is capable of melting enough water in the summer long enough to support any microbes. Moving to the second fun fact. 2. Mars has two moons, and one of them is doomed. Mars' moons are among the smallest in the solar system. The planet has two asteroid-like moons called Phobos and Deimos, because they have compositions that are similar to asteroids found elsewhere in the solar system. According to NASA, most scientists believe the red planet's gravity snatched the moons long ago and forced them into orbit. But in the life of the solar system, Phobos has a pretty short lifetime. In about 30 million to 50 million years, Phobos is going to crash into Mars' surface or rip apart because the tidal force of the planet will prove too much to resist. They suggest a massive inner moon eventually succumbed to the tidal pull of Mars and fell back to the red planet, as did the majority of other outer moons that formed within the reaches of tidal forces. This left behind Phobos and Deimos as the only survivors of the giant impact. 3. Mars used to have a thicker atmosphere For water to flow in the past, the red planet needs more atmosphere, so something must have changed in the past few billion years. What? It is thought that the sun's energy striking the atmosphere must have stripped the lighter forms of hydrogen from the top, scattering the molecules into space. Over long periods of time, this would lessen the amount of atmosphere near Mars. This question is being investigated in more detail with NASA's Mars Atmosphere and Volatile Evolution MAVEN, spacecraft. The new result reveals that solar wind and radiation were responsible for most of the atmospheric loss on Mars, and the depletion was enough to transform the Martian climate. The solar wind is a thin stream of electricity conducting gas constantly blowing out from the surface of the Sun. 4. Mars has some extreme highs and lows in terrain The surface gravity of Mars is only 37% of what you would find on Earth, which makes it possible for volcanoes to be taller without collapsing. This is why we have Olympus Mons, the tallest volcano known on a planet in the solar system. It's 16 miles 25 kilometers high, and its diameter is approximately the same as the state of Arizona, according to NASA. But Mars also has a deep and wide canyon known as Valles Marineris, after the spacecraft Mariner 9 that discovered it. In some parts, the canyon is 4 miles 7 kilometers deep. 
According to NASA, the valley is as wide as the United States and is about 20% of the red planet's diameter. Wait, wait, before we go any further, make sure to subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon so you can get notifications of more amazing facts delivered directly to your inbox. 5. We have pieces of Mars on Earth Remember the low gravity on Mars that we talked about? In the past, the planet has been hit by large asteroids, just like Earth. Most of the debris fell back on the planet, but some of it was ejected into space. That sparked an incredible journey where the debris moved around the solar system and in some cases landed on Earth. The technical name for these meteorites is called SNC, Shergatites, Nokalites, Chassignites, types of geologic composition. Gases trapped in some of these meteorites has been practically identical to what NASA's Viking landers sampled on the Red Planet in the 1970s and 1980s. 6. Mars would kill an unprotected astronaut quickly Unlike our home planet, Mars can be deadly because of its atmosphere. It can kill you within minutes if you forget your safety precautions. There are a lot of unpleasant scenarios for somebody who took off their helmet. First, Mars is usually pretty cold. Its average temperature is minus 50 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 45 degrees Celsius at the mid-latitudes. Second, it has practically no atmosphere. The air pressure on Mars is only 1% of what we have, on average, on the Earth's surface. And third, even if it did have atmosphere, the composition is not compatible with the nitrogen-oxygen mix humans require. Specifically, Mars has about 95% carbon dioxide, 3% nitrogen, 1.6% argon, and a few other elements in its atmosphere. 7. Mars is a popular spacecraft destination There have been so many spacecraft that attempted a Martian mission that it's hard to pick notable ones. NASA's Vikings were the first landers in 1976. In fact, NASA is the only agency that has managed to land on the planet so far. Some of its other missions include Pathfinder Sojourner, the first lander-rover combination, in 1997, the Mars Exploration Rover Spirit and Opportunity in 2004, and the Curiosity Rover of 2012. And this doesn't even mention the fleet of orbiters that have mapped Mars over the years from the Soviet Union, NASA, the European Space Agency, and India. And there are many more spacecraft to come in the next decade. Well, space lovers, that's all for today. Hope you like to know these interesting facts about the Red Planet. If you want to know more about it, or you have some amazing things which you know about Mars, share your thoughts in the comments section. Thanks for giving your precious time to the Space and Galaxy Facts. We are striving to make your time worth watching our videos. Please leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more spicy and exciting facts about Space and Galaxy. Have a good one. We are out.